Hi friends, it's Donna with Past and Pages. Thank you for joining me today. So it's been a little while since I've been able to do a really good video with you guys. I do have some things in mind coming up to do that I'm pretty excited about. And we had our daughter here, one of our daughters here for about a week. And then after that, we went out of state for a few days. And now we're back and we've been kind of transitioning from probably moving to probably not moving right now. And I've been unpacking boxes and reorganizing everything. So we are just kind of getting settled again. And I have been doing a little bit of crafting, but not a lot. Um, some days I, I have been doing um, several hours of painting because I just, I just needed to do it. And then I started having some um, side effects from the ingredients in the paint that I'm allergic to. So I had to put that away for a while. But I'll just show you guys. This is a composition book. And I've just been working on making paint and texture and designs on these pages. And just having fun with it. And just, you know putting in it what I want, but I had to put that away for a while, and then I'll have to come back after the, um, the allergies kind of died down, and maybe wear some gloves and put a window up so that I can work in that more. I also did some single sheets of paper, started on some painted paper, single sheets like, like these for journals. I like adding them to my journals. So, I did also manage to get a little bit of time in here, not a lot. I'll just show you guys, I've been adding things in here that I'm going to use. I'm going to try to get some spreads done in here on camera with you guys. And um, so here's an, one example. Um, I just added this and these sentiments. This, I had already put this down and written this. This is what was on the back of the uh, photo, 1927 Hudson River. So, uh, I did the same thing that I've done here on the other side of this fabric. I made a pocket like that with that. And so, I haven't put anything in it yet, but I'm going to. So, I did that. I'm trying to see what else that I've added um, this will be a good page to do a spread together I need to do that this week if at all possible um, here this was just laying on top of this and I just hadn't sewn it in yet so I added this little doily piece this coffee dyed sewed it in just for layering and texture and so i do like a lot of writing space in my journal and i am going to definitely probably keep that like that but i do still have some more embellishing i'm gonna do in this journal but that is for another day another different video um i wanted to show you this gorgeous cute just yummy journal that I bought from Lynn at a bit of bird song. Um, I'll put the links to her shop and her channel below. But I just saw this. I thought it was super cute. And I just went ahead and purchased it. So it's layers of fabric. And I really like how the cover is oversized for the signature. Let's see that. And that's her stamp. Lots of messy stitching. I love that. Um, here is the inside. So it's a really nice big pocket. Lots of messy stitching on each side with strings. I love that. So I have started adding a little in here. Very little. Just a few little things. This came on the packaging. So I just added it in here. I added those that I pulled off of something else. And I think she did a flip through with this as well. 
on her channel. Some more of that washi tape that came on the packaging is there. So I'll probably be getting some more done in here too. I'm really excited about it. So hopefully it'll get my creative creativity going. Um, I did pull this off of a different journal and I think I'm going to use it on this one. As part of this journal. But anyway, I just thought I would pop on and give you guys a quick update of what's been going on and give you a little bit of a, a update on, you know, what I've got planned coming soon to work in this journal. Hopefully this week uh, I'll get that done so and get the video up. So I appreciate you guys watching so much. I hope you guys are having uh, a good week and that you are taking care of yourselves and finding time to be creative and that you guys are hanging in there. So I uh, will talk to you later. Bye-bye.